Since we've changed locales, I thought, what a better time to do a late night, low rent tour of my new sewing space slash filming area. So let's go. Welcome to The Sewing Report. I'm Jennifer Moore, helping you discover your love of sewing. And right now, I'm gonna take you on the first ever tour of my new space. Now this is a two bedroom, two bathroom apartment. And my husband has very graciously given up the entire living dining room space for me and my sewing and filming. This is the main area and in the cabinet on the left, I've got my vintage Singer sewing machine. Then I've got my Ikea cabinet that has some fabric and some other tchotchkes in there. We're moving over to the very nice sewing table. My husband made that for me for Christmas. And in the back, you see a dress form that is still in movers plastic. I don't know, I sort of like it. I might go with it. I've got my Janome 7700 sitting there and I've got my big cutting mat. And previously my husband did a review on that. If you're interested in checking it out, it's there. And around the room, I've got some lights. So in the back, I've got that um, light. It sort of fills the, sh so it makes it so there's no shadows on the wall, it's sort of like a fill light. And then I've got this light here and I will link those as well. If you're interested in photography or, you know, filmmaking, whatnot. This is my sewing assistant. It's obviously a cat, sometimes she helps, sometimes she doesn't. All right, I'm gonna show you the space a little more. Here is the back of the desk. And one thing we really liked about this space is that there's enough room behind the desk and in front of the desk where you could put a camera in either position. So there's a lot of room in here for us to move things around. Over here, I'll show you what's in some of the drawers. I'm still trying to figure things out, but I just sort of put stuff in the drawers and I figured I would kind of deal with everything later. Lots of stuff in here. All right, lots of stuff in here, random notions and thread. These boxes are actually gonna be featured in another video, but they were sent to me and I'm a fan. They're really great for small storage. So bins and things, everybody, and I'll link those too. And here's more random stuff in here. So yeah, clearly I have a lot of organizing to do and I'm still not sure where everything is. The other thing we like is that if we need to tape a non-sewing video, we can do so. And the backdrop doesn't look too overtly sewing. All I have to do is move that dress form out of the way and we are good to go. And yes, you can see how high budget this uh, space is. I've got a folding chair and then it wasn't tall enough. So my husband made sort of a, uh, I don't know, elevator for it, who knows. Moving on over to this area here. This is where the magic happens. Okay, not really. But this is my computer, and you can see it's it's pretty uh, pretty uh, relaxed here. And you may have noticed this creepy plastic on the chair. Again, the movers put that on there, and I don't know, I, I kind of dig it. It makes keeps the chair clean, so I'm cool with that. And you may see the prom mug. Got the prom mug going on here, and this is a mug rug I just made yesterday. To do the live show, I always use the Blue Yeti microphone and my husband and I share it. He also uses it for gaming. And the PC was a custom build that James did. And also, of course, to the right, I put a little pillow on the floor for the cat because, you know, she's in charge of everything. So that is where I do all my editing, all the computer stuff. I'm over here a lot. And even since I was a kid, I was kind of addicted to computers. So I spend a lot of time over here. Right now, this is sort of my makeshift ironing spot, but that's probably gonna go away. I do have to iron some shirts later. And this is the sale rate that I don't use. To the left are the Maxi Mail subscription boxes. On the floor are some patterns. And I got those like plastic file folders, you know, from big box stores. And I find they're good for keeping patterns in. And here's some fabric and other stuff that I don't really have a place for and the ever so and sewing machine and my brother serger and then some more random stuff over there so again you can see this is definitely not a fancy space by any means so hopefully this makes you feel better about your own if you're like wow i can't get my sewing room to look like all the ones on pinterest all right seriously who does all righty and over here we've got the lighting and tripod all of this stuff is from Amazon. Obviously, I'm an Amazon fan, and there is a link to my storefront down below in the description box. Not trying to have this be an Amazon commercial, but it kind of is. Anyways, that's my sewing space. It's basically one room. 
But so far I'm loving it and I hope to do a lot of sewing in it. 